of a lot for Tall Man. Don't go. He nails a goal with United. McCormick with the cross. Brianna Real just checks that all is in order. Stephen Walsh, the United front runner, gets the game underway here and he rolls it back to Killian Bruder. Bruder drills it forward. Local finals, more than 50 matches played at Eamon DC Park in the month of May. Hurley with the left footed free kick goes low and hard. Bruder oh, with the front okay. post flick, takes a deflection. Off to Silva, it seems, out for a corner kick. But in a bit the bit of a zola, a bit of a flick, but it's just good defender from the Finn Hatsper. Former Coveman Hurley with the corner kick goes into the area. Nugent climbs high, just can't steer his head. Instructions from the technical area. Bruder will take this free kick for United. Sweeps it in the direction of Walsh. Walsh heads it down to Manley. Rob Manley to Regan Don. Donnan left foot across into the, the area. Good ball it is to Walsh. Oh, yes. For Darren Clark. Comes steaming in at the back post. Darren Clark, the former Longford Town man. Fights for the United Wood to the good alley. Yeah, fabulous ball in from Donnan. Uh, and a uh, great finish at the back post. Especially uh, one that keeps saying it all year, Keen. Bit of quality into the box. And the player arriving, Darren Clark, are doing the world of good, you know. Trying to get into the team now. And great start for him. Darren Clark, second goal of the campaign. Some would argue that he should have three, but their effort against Longford Town here when he came off the bench to make a big impact on that particular evening. He also scored down at a Ferry Carrick Park as well as this evening, but officially a second goal. Some fixtures Friday, Monday didn't go so well for United. They shaded one against Cove Ramblers, then lost away to Longford. McCormick with the free, with the corner kick, headed away by Mashigo. Darren Clark, the goal scorer, has it back. Hurley rolls a pass out to McCormack. McCormack to Darren Clark. Clark into the area. Clark with the left foot across. Flashes across. Oh, oh yes. Killian Bruder, the coolest man in Eamon DC Park. And he supplies another goal. His third of the campaign. Going United lead by two goals to nil. Fine build up play. Darren Clark with the cross. Bruder with the finish, Ali. Yeah, look at the just hit the nail in the head there, team. Lovely play between uh, Hurley, McCormack, and Clark with the assist. The, the, the ball in on the floor to, to brood the coolest man on the ground the way he put it away into the back of the net great goal for goal put them two up did have summoned in the opening quarter here and another chance for Conor McCormick to test the Finn Harps defence from this set piece situation Conor McCormick the United skipper and tallies man fires it into the yes. area header from Stephen Walsh 3-0 to go away United McCormick with the cross from the corner Stephen Walsh with have been secured so far in the season McCormick with the corner kick Keith Cowan heads it away only as far as Darren Clark Clark to Stephen Walsh Walsh looks for McCormick McCormick skips inside to win it back Nugent sweeps it into the area Heimer at the second attempt claims assisted by Keith Cowan who was there to deny Rob Manley and Galway United and Finn Harps 30 victories for Galway United 21 draws 24 Harps wins corner kick once again for Conor McCormick decorated player in the SSE or Tricity League McCormick into Brilliant. the area header there Absolutely. from Morris Nugent it seems it is indeed <laughs> he 
with the header. Stephen Walsh not too far away, but no Baba. Just thumps it forward. Hurley with the header. Stephen Walsh. Mashigo clips it over the top looking for O'Donnell. Well O'Donnell, good save though from Brendan Clark and Killian Bruder clips it towards Rob Manley. It's a chaotic kind of a match here, even though United lead by four goals to nil. There's no rhyme or reason to it at the moment, Ali. No, but even Clark there as well, you know, he had nothing to do for the, all the game, but his concentration level was spot on the minute they got in behind. Cormac will take dangerous delivery into the area headed away by the visitors only as far as Killian Bruder Bruder to Darren Clark scored one and created another cross into the area Stephen Walsh climbs high Heimer saves well yeah, I'm surprised Bruder didn't take on the volley of the box uh, Manley Manley with the shot no Baba to De Silva but it definitely looks as if Baba's been pushed into a midfield role Clark though has a back for United Darren Clark does ever so well he's crossed it Stephen Walsh Walsh with the header Heimer though saves well for Harps yeah well it hadn't worked keen playing the five at the back that he had to do he said he's, well, you know, he's a great replacement for Slevin Nugent you know he's very consistent um, nearly every time he plays for Galway he really puts a foot wrong Clark to McCarthy another brilliant pass from Brendan Clark to McCarthy too Regan Donlan, Keith Cowan with the header only as far as Evan O'Connor, O'Connor hits it, Rob Manley adds to it, Heimer with another save for Harps <laughs> a support from Evan O'Connor who's dashed forward intelligently O'Connor to Stephen Walsh, Walsh Rob Manley in the area. Rob Manley oh, with the finish. 5 0 Galway United. Rob Manley with the goal. An opportunistic finish from Rob Manley, Ollie. Yeah, look at the referee did well there, given his, his due. He could have pulled it up for a free kick um, after Evan O'Connor dispatched the ball to Stephen Walsh. Stephen Walsh did very well to get over his feet, and, and the ball broke kindly for, for Manley. The defender was disappointed he couldn't have dealt with it better. But look at him, delight for Manley as well. He finished it well in the corner, and he's performance this evening has warranted a goal and look at that's his job is set it forward and for him to score now is it's, it's a bit of kudos to him as well no games this season Manley to Lomboto Lomboto dashes into the area Heimer with the challenge and the referee points to the spot Adriano Real gives the penalty Francie Lomboto Galway United career as a crowd gathers behind the goal Dave Hurley to take Waits for the whistle. Dave Hurley makes it the six for Galway United. A tenth of the campaign for Dave Hurley. Yeah. Dominant. Yeah. Killian Bruder rifles it into a packed area. Nugent glances it forward. Oh. Header there from Gordon off the post. Manley just couldn't supply the finish and it'll be a goal kick. Yeah, this seemed to be slow motion. The header from Gordon um, that came off the cross purpose. Uh, just fell the wrong side for Manny to, to finish it. Riano Real blasts a full time whistle. A satisfactory evening, Ollie, for Galway United. A six goal to nil win over Finn Harps at Even BC Park. Yeah, they, look, they come out of the blocks very quickly, Galway. And that, they were phenomenal the energy levels and the quality for the first 20 minutes of the game. You know, the, the, John would have, and Ollie would have done their homework too with Finn Harps. Long journey down here. That's, that's a, a good start now this evening, and they did. And the, the quality of the play and the delivery, but the, the pleasing thing for John, obviously, the. the